going on youtubers this is dre from blacksmith rc coming at you with the uh, rest of the hot racing aluminum truss video uh, we've got project slither here and i have installed everything um, now what i did even though you can't see it um, i did install the hot racing aluminum truss uh, i did have to cut the bottom part post off the front axle to get that to fit but it fit in perfectly and now I have true four link uh, four link suspension in the front um, the atomic three link was uh, hitting the drive axle just a little bit when it compressed so I had to figure out something so I went with the uh, hot racing aluminum truss and it works great uh, there's no binding or anything like that at all now so that's great and it matches the rear which is also uh, the custom four link uh, what I did also do is I added the RPM rock sliders um, being that this is a one-off uh, one-of-a-kind type crawler I had to remake the upper rear links to fit the stock mounting points for the RPM rock sliders you have to use the two mounting points one that goes into the um, bottom plate motor mount whatever you call it and the one that goes in for the uh, upper rear link in the rear um, same thing in the front so I had to remake those so that fits in here perfectly now so that's great and uh, it wasn't waterproof so what I did I went with the Traxxas receiver box <clears throat> tried and true it is waterproof now um, I just drilled a hole in the bottom mounted it right there where the you can see that where the stock bolt goes right there for the RPM and uh, put a washer a little rubber washer on the inside tighten it all down so now it is still waterproof and secure so that makes no problem there also I did keep the um, receiver box from Axial all I did was uh, put little pieces of plastic up here to lift it up just a little so now when it fully compresses it doesn't hit the box it goes all the way down to the axle so that gives me a little bit more articulation which is great so there it is guys slithers upgrades for um, this week uh, maybe we'll have some more next week or another running video um, I'm almost ready to take it out on the trail um, just a few more little odds and ends and um, be looking forward to another longer video of me actually out on the trail getting this thing a little dirty so you guys have a good week and keep making it do what it do and I'll catch you on the next video.